must do what must be done. This guy is an asshole and he deserves punished. You were wrong, Cardinal. I do have it in me. Thank you. Thank you, my child. Ben! What happened up there? It's over. I made sure Genovese won't bother blood. anyone else ever again. You... you killed him? He was a bad guy. He deserved to die. He may have caused innocent people to die, but that doesn't give you the right to kill him. He was an old man, Ben. It's not like he was much of a threat. But... I thought... What kind of person just kills an old man like that? I'm sorry, Ben, but I don't think I can be around you right now. Uh-oh. Alice, wait! I can't believe she'd just leave me after all of this. I'm terribly sorry, Mr. Jordan, but perhaps things between you two will resolve themselves later. So what happens now? I'm not sure. I suggest you go back to your hotel before the police arrive. I'll stay here and deal with them. What's going to happen with you now that there's no more Knights of St. Anthony? An excellent question. I'm not sure exactly what will happen next, but I'm going to try and make the most of whatever time I have left here. I'd better go see if I can find Alice. Some time later. After dropping Ben off at Waterloo Station, Otto Schneider returned to the Third Eye to resume his duties as doorman. Oblivious to events in Paris, he spent the rest of his time in London with Madame Tilly. Okay. Eventually, Otto moved back to Germany, where he continued to dabble in paranormal investigating till he lost interest and decided to pursue his other lifelong dream, gourmet cooking. Madame Tilly Rosenquist continued amusing and scamming easily impressed tourists and locals alike at her shop with her theatrics. Unfortunately, her career was brought to an abrupt end after accidentally falling down her front steps stairs during a particularly hammy performance. As per her final request, her ashes were mixed into oil paints used to create a posthumous self-portrait, which was later mailed to James Randi. Simon Booth saw what became of Ben after the events of Notre Dame and tried appearing to him to offer help, but Ben dismissed him as just a figment of his imagination. Disgusted by the fact that Ben had killed Cardinal Genovese, Alice wanted nothing to do with him. She went back into hiding and didn't contact him again. Though it, he, it pained her to sever her ties with Ben despite all they had been through, she knew she could never be with a murderer. Percival Quentin Jones decided to spend the remainder of his time on Earth visiting places he had never been. One of his lifelong dreams, was, which was successfully accomplished, was attending a wine tasting in Champagne region of France, where he was briefly reunited with Ben. In the end, Percy left this world fulfilled and went on to reunite with his old friend Arthur, with whom he went on the next great adventure. Having killed Cardinal Genovese and lost Alice, Ben found himself incredibly depressed. He spent the next few days drowning his sorrows in bars across Paris. Soon Ben found himself at a chateau in the Champagne region of France, where he investigated a haunting. He later went on to have a few more act cases. However, he found his heart just wasn't in it anymore, and he eventually quit paranormal investigating and returned to Philadelphia, where he lapsed deeper into alcoholism and despair. Ben often reflected on his time as a paranormal investigator. Despite the tragedies and hardships, he always regarded it with some fondness. The career of Ben Jordan Paranormal Investigator may have been short, but he learned more in those five months than most people do in a lifetime. Writing art and scripting, Francisco Gonzalez. Music, Peter Gressa. AGS Engine, Chris Jones. Beta Testers, 
Edmundo Ruiz, Francisco Aruiz, Stephen Rolton. Motion capture actors, Maria Flores, Javier Ruiz, Jessica Vecvecos, Francisco Gonzalez. Voice cast, Ben Jordan, Eric Furstein, Arch Arthur Jordan, Drew Wellman, Percival Quentin Jones, Chris Jones, Alice Wilkins, Jessica Vetranos, Vetranos, Simon Booth, Adam Cronin, Cardinal Genovese, Philip Sacramento, Donovan the Enforcer, Andy Marshall, British Librarian, Steve Rulton, Seamus, Rowan Himitz, Seminarian, Daily S Father Flanagan, Shane Stevens, Otto Schneider, Kozak, Madame Tilly Rosenquist, Becky Lay, Enforcer 2, Daniel Bronfe, Dragomir, Van Leeton, Florian, Michael Steve Pangolis, Innkeeper, Adam Hay, Record Keeper, Tanny Canahem, Bar Patron, Anthony Carboni, Trans Strange Woman, Francisco Gonzalez, Soren Trells, Edwin Tyong, Enforcer 3, Francisco Gonzalez, Hostel, Cl Hostel Clerk, Miranda Gualin, Sacra Cool Priest No. 1, Peter Gresser, Sacra Priest No. 2, Francisco Gonzalez, Urban Explorer, Jessica, Map Seller, Javier Ruiz, Sister, Aaron Clooney, Max, Winter Harbo, Tony and Miranda Golan. And there we have all the cast listed, all the voice actors and actresses. Special thanks to all the voice actors, Edmundo Ruiz, Stephen Rulton, the AGS community, you for playing. <laughs>